damn it, you boys crossed the Iron Ridge. Dick, I told you. Just listen. No, Mike. They were here, in Rogue Camp. Rogue Camp? There were Rippers in Rogue Camp? You sure it was Rippers? I'm sure as Jesus, Mike, yeah. They're kind of hard to miss, you know, with the scars and acting crazy, killing anything that moves. All right, just calm down. We got a parlay with Carlos. Schizo's heading over to Iron Butte tomorrow. He'll find out what the hell's going on, and then we'll... You're sending Schizo to parlay with Carlos, Jesus, Mike. Don't tell me how to run my camp, Deke. Like I said, my treaty is gonna hold. Lost Lake out. Hell, whatever you say, Mike. Whatever you say, Schizo's... Right. You're gonna get everyone killed. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. What does Nero want? They disappear for two years, come back guns blazing? Don't bother trying to find out. You'll get yourself killed. Besides, we already know. Watching them skulk around. I think they know these woods better than me. They're doing something with the freaks. Tracking them. Studying them. Watching them. Making notes in their little notebooks. And you know why? They're gathering info. Seeing how long it takes for these sons of bitches to die or starve off. Probably trying to get a read on when the feds can reemerge from their hidey holes and crawl back into their unjust positions of power. The freaks are on our side. The longer they're here, the longer the feds can rot down there in their stony prison. The world may not be ours anymore, but thanks to the freaks, it doesn't belong to the feds either. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Once again, Cope, you don't know shit. The freaks ain't on anybody's side. In the world, it already belongs to them. Hey, Boozer. I'm, uh, I'm heading up to Marion Forks. Marion Forks? What the hell for? As I decided... Well, it's like you said, I've, uh, I've mourned her long enough. It's time to say goodbye. You went to the church? I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Oh, Jesus, Deke. It's the last time, Boozer, I swear, Deke it out. Oh, what the hell? Uh, that's worth checking out.
I gotta burn out the rest of these nests. So sorry that no one came. <laughs> I guess we really pissed off everyone on both sides. Well, I mean, not everyone. But I want you to know that that's how much you mean to me. That I would give up anything for you. Anything. This ring is a symbol of my love. And it is precious. It has no beginning and no end. I love you. Shit, more of them. Stay out! This ring is my promise that I'm always going to love you. And I ain't ever going to leave you. But you, you may kiss the bride. Oh, wait, wait a second. Here, you can have this one back, but only if you promise to ride me as much as you ride your bike. Who's man? You there? Yeah, Deke. What's up? 
remember that little church, the one Sarah and I got married in? Well, I found a couple of assholes trash in the place. Wish I'd been there. Might have helped you kill them all. Messing with Sarah's church. Shit. Yeah, anyway, just checking in, peeking out. Okay, at last. Addy, you there? Lost Lake Infirmary, can you read me? Deacon, I'm here. Addy, good, good. Look, um, are you gonna be around for a while? I, uh, I, I need to see you. Is everything okay? Yeah. What's wrong? That should be it. Uh, look, nothing. I'm, I'll tell you when I get there. Deacon out. Later, burn out these nests. There, there. Damn it, sniper ambush. Oh shit, none now. Lost one! Yeah. 
murderer. Someone <laughs> Deer crossing. Wow, oh, that's not too smart without the traffic. Ah, oh, that's right. I gotta finish burning out this infestation zone. I guess I'll come back here and finish burning this infestation zone later. <sighs> Should look for fuel. Got what you need? Yeah, everything I could think of. Let's go. Well, you sound pretty excited. It's the candle, Dee. What? The old saying, it's better to light one candle than curse the darkness. We've spent the last two years doing a whole lot of cursing. We get the lights on at last leg and that's lighting our first candle. Yeah, only one problem with that. And what's that, Deke? Lights attract all kinds of nasty bugs, and they make it way easier for him to find you. Hey, we're here. Shit. Swarmers. I was hoping it was going to be clear. Nah, why would we have that kind of luck? Okay, I think that's all of them. Crap. Okay, to fix this thing, I gotta climb up there. <laughs> Have you done this before? Nope, but there's a first time for everything, right? Right. Okay, come on, boost me up. All right, ready? Uh-huh. If you fall, it ain't like I can catch you. Gee, thanks. Ah! I'll try to keep that in mind. Well, 
God damn it. Well, that was fun. Yeah, we're gonna have to come out and do this again sometime. Yeah, I'll talk to Schizo about getting some barbed wire around this. It'll keep the newts off. Yeah, sounds like the kind of shit job he likes to give me. <laughs> You'll live. Come on, I gotta check something else out. Okay. So, your old lady? Okay, how the hell did... It's not hard to put two and two together, Deke. How you lost her at that refugee camp. The one north of Belknap. And in the last few weeks, we've seen Nero choppers in the air, and you were hoping for what? A miracle? That she was with them somehow? Something like that. But she's not. No. I'm sorry. Look, it's not a big deal, so let's just drop it. Okay. Hey. Wow. Word gets around. I'm almost ready. Power to the whole resort is routed through here. I pulled the breaker a week ago, so it wouldn't short out. Okay. Ready when you are. All right. Let's listen up. Okay. Now, the past few months have been tough. Not gonna deny that. We're low on food, medicine, hell. Pretty much everything. But we got one thing in spades. And without that, everything else is meaningless. That one thing is trust. Yeah. Yeah. Now, a while ago, we had some more drifters right in the camp. Some of you said kick them out. We ain't got enough for ourselves. Some of you said we can't trust them. Tonight, is proof of what I've been saying all along. Yeah. We yeah. need everyone. I mean everyone who is willing to be here, who is willing to work, who is willing to help us rebuild. Yeah. Now for the past couple of months, Ricky has been doing just that. She can't do it alone. She needs help. Tonight is going to happen because we welcomed a drifter into our camp. And we allowed him to earn our trust. Tonight, we take one more step out of the darkness. Yeah. Dumb question. I'm I'm sorry, Deke. No, don't be. She's uh she's been dead a long time. Still, it can't be easy to get your hopes up like that only to I, I don't know. I wish there was something I could do. Well, there is. What? Stop talking about it. Okay. Addie? Addie! Oh, the lights are up. I don't think she's here. Addie, you here? Okay, well, strip. Strip, strip what? Take your shirt off, sit on the table. Hey, look, it's nothing. 
Deacon, do you want an infection? Mm hmm I may be an engineer, Deke, but that does not mean uh, that I don't know how to treat a cut. Yeah, I never would have guessed the way that you were caressing those switches and circuits or whatever the hell you were doing. <laughs> All right, this <clears throat> might hurt just a little bit. Ready? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Really? No, I want to just wait for Addie to come back, just, huh? Shh. Hang on. There. It's done. Big baby. So I told you it was nothing. <laughs> yeah, you did. <clears throat> oh, wow. You really have been at war. Yeah, more than one. Shit, that's right. Where was this one? Afghanistan or the MC or after? I, uh, I don't remember. What about this one? Ricky, uh, I'm not sure that, uh, well, I heard that Addie doesn't really like, um, people messing around in her. Yeah, I, I heard that too. What about this one? Dick, I'm not married. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Why don't you come back tomorrow and see Addie and she's gonna tell you how great of a job I did. Ricky, um... Deke, it's, it's, it's fine. You're welcome. Hey, Deacon? <clears throat> Maybe one day, stop and light a candle. It can get pretty dark and cold out there. You two were always so close. Yeah, you really were like a brother and sister. Joe, you will never know how much Boozer misses you. Addie. Hey, Deacon, how can I help you? Uh, it's Boozer. Is he okay? He's, yeah, not well. He's not. He's not sick or anything. It's just, I don't know. Well, I told you that it was going to be a big adjustment. Do you have any drugs around here? Like antidepressants, something like that? No. Sorry. Okay. Wait. I heard about what happened. How we went after those guys who were killing those dogs. Yeah, and he nearly got us killed while doing it. Well, maybe that's your answer. Nearly getting us killed while doing it? Look, what does William love so much that he'd be willing to risk his own life? He doesn't need something to heal his body. He needs something to heal his soul. I got it. Thanks, Eddie.
You're the assholes who tried to ambush me. Shoot on. So hard.
Hey, buddy. Hello. How's it going, pal? Come here. Hey, buddy. Hello. Come here, buddy. Hey. Hello. All right, come here. Come on. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, my God. All right, all right, all right. Fine. Have it your way. Hey, huh, what? wake up, Ooh. you lazy bastard. What's going on, man? What the hell's this? Shit. Hey, oh, easy, easy. <laughs> hey, hey, come on. Come on, huh? Where'd you come from? Don't look at me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, you look a little thirsty. Let's, uh, let's get you some water. Let's get some water. I'm here. What do you want? Hold on. Come on, in here. Excuse me, what's going on? Well, if you go inside, I'll show you. Hey, I've been thinking about your idea. You know the one where you want to seal the cave north of the camp to cut down on the hordes passing through our farm area? Okay. Problem is... Mike hasn't been able to find any deck cord for this, has he? No. But I know where you can get some. Right here. No. <laughs> I know what you're no. thinking. I get it. No, that's okay. in the middle of Ripper territory. Last time I went through there, You got it didn't... meds that saved your boy's no. life. We get the deck cord, we blow the cave, boom, goodbye horde. Uh -huh. It was your goddamn idea! Look, they have sealed the goddamn border. They sealed the tunnel. If I go through there, I'm starting a war. I Excuse got me. a plan. Besides, I'm going with you. Keep your ass out of trouble. Just grab as much gear as you can. Hopefully we won't need it, but you never know. And then meet me here. Because there's a trail that goes over Iron Ridge. What? Right there. What are you talking about? 
Just trust me. Jesus. You in? I'll see you there. Hey, I'm a... I even found an old water heater that works. I guess I'm gonna get my hot shower, yeah? Great, great. Hey, where are you? Look, uh, Schizo and I, we're, we're gonna get the debt cord for those explosives and we're gonna seal the caves, remember? Yeah. What are you doing? What we're gonna do is go in through their goddamn back door. On foot? You never told me we were going on foot. Remember what happened the last time you took your noisy ass bike in there? Good point. Hey, they'll never even see us. So, uh, Iron Mike. Said that he sent you to parlay with Carlos? Wait, the old man told you that? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Okay. I guess there's no harm in you being there, you know? Seeing as how you and your bro are part of the camp now? Oh, it must have gone well, seeing as how we're just going in through what? What'd you call it? Their goddamn back door? The meet and greet? Oh, yeah, it went swell. Like trying to negotiate with a barrel of monkeys all whacked out on PCP. But you know what? As long as we don't get caught tonight, the old man's treaty might just hold after all. Even though Boozer and I just had a run-in with them at Rogue Camp. Hey, Carlos said there was a mistake. Some rogue rippers. Get it? <laughs> anyway, he said it wouldn't happen again. And you believe him? <laughs> what the hell do I know? I'm just one of Mike's flunkies. Same as you. <clears throat> Shit. You hear that? Yeah, wolves. You think they're infected? Yes, we're gonna find out. How'd you get through before? Hey, there used to be a, an old wooden ladder left by miners or spelunkers or some shit. Come on, over here, boost me up. You ready? Yeah. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. Look around down there. 
See if that ladder's there somewhere. I'll take a look up here. Okay, hurry it up. We gotta be in and out of Ripper territory before it gets light. Yeah? Tell me something I don't know. Wolves! Look out! I got him! So, where the hell are you? Hold on, hold on, I got it. I can sell this. Watch your head. Got it. Found a map in Mike's papers, showing some of these old Forest Service trails. I'm sure Iron Mike loves you rifling through his shit. What the old man doesn't know won't hurt him. Sure. Anyways, you can see the trail's in bad shape. It was marked on the map as closed. Fire. You ever seen one before? No. They call it a gathering. Heard they do all kind of messed up crap. <laughs> Let's go around. I don't want any part of that. How with that? I want to see it. What? You got a death wish? Not anymore. Look, I just, I want to see for myself what these assholes go through, you know, rest in peace, get low, all that shit. Okay, okay. But you stick with me. We get separated, and we're in deep shit. <laughs> Following you. You're sure this is the right way? Yeah. Why? I used to ride through here back in the day. What? 
My old lady used to work out here. There was a research lab east of Iron Butte Lodge. Anyway, I'd ride out here. I swear the transportation complex is back that way. Let's just keep going. You'll see. It's this way. They use air horns to attract freaks. Come on. Start a war. Give me a second. Give me a second. Oh, Jesus. Somebody. Someone, please. Come on. Please. Come help on, we gotta me. go. No, no, no. We're not leaving her to the freaks. What? No. This is Jesus, we are not leaving This her. is not why we are here. You did the right thing, you know. Just drop it, Schizo. We've all had to do. Drop it. Shit fucking crazy. You ever seen their leader, Carlos? No. He looks crazier than any of them. Got scars all over his back, arms, legs. And that's what I keep telling Mike. You can't have a treaty with crazy people. I told you, Schizo, I'm not going against Iron Mike. Come on. There's gotta be another way in. Hey, hold up. Let's take a look around. What are you talking about? Well, we have no idea what's in there, so let's look around. 
See if we can scavenge anything. Yeah, yeah, okay, sure. Why not? Take a look around and uh, see if you can find anything. What do you think? Try this door? Wait, 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 slow down. You don't know what's in there. This time of night, it's yeah. clear. Don't worry. I never saw it. It was on me so fast. Yeah, that can happen. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Hey, Deke. I owe you one. I mean it. Uh, here, help me. We can get in through here. Oh, I don't know, man. Come on. Fine. Are we still going in there? We got a choice. You ready? Pull! You get under, I'll hold it. No, 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 you go! I got it! Go! Go, go, go! Okay. Hey, hold it for me! Ah, oh, shit. God damn it! Yeah, it's jammed. Pull! Yeah, it's jammed! Okay. No, that's all right. All right, uh, go around. I'll find a way to open the side door from here. Deke? Deke! Deke! Locked inside a warehouse with a bunch of pissed off newts. What do you think's going on? That did it. Here, here, the door's unlocked. Jesus. You okay? Yeah, just a little newt, right? Come on. Yeah, let's just uh, find the dead cords.
What do you think? Foreman's office is up there. That's where they'd keep it. Oh, great. How are we gonna get up there? Ah, uh, come on. I'll give you a boost. <laughs> wait, wait. You just want me to go first, in case there's something up there. Oh, you got me. Now, come on. Yeah, okay. <sighs> All right, you ready? Yeah. Up. Okay, up. <clears throat> oh, my God. Okay, I'm up. Give me a sec. Find something I can use to climb up. Here, watch your head. Got it. Hey, this has got to be it. Bingo. Here, hold this open while I grab it. Why don't I just grab it? Why you so long? Trust me. As a matter of fact, I do. Come on, let's get the hell out of here. Schizo, I, uh, I just want to say thank you. Nah, nah, man. For coming out here with me, helping out. Jesus, just... Uh... No, I mean it. I mean, we weren't exactly welcome in Lost Lake. Just drop it, okay? All right, Skizzle, once we get back to camp, why don't you look? What are you doing? I'm sorry, brother. It was the only way. <laughs> 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 